let's get a card for today. I kind of didn't have time to get a daily up yesterday, which would have been June 24th. So today, June 25th, what do you have? We have two of Michael. All right, so you might find yourself a little conflicted. Uh, <laughs> I'm hearing total like cognitive dissonance, right? So something along those lines might be occurring for you. This could also be someone coming to you or who is around you who is very two-faced or of two moods, okay? So you might have that person who's normally kind of like really, really nasty and then you kind of have a good day with them. Now what's going to happen? You're going to end up letting your guard down. You're going to see that they're making an effort. You want to honor that effort and then they can come back in and, you know, come back in and get you. All right, two of Michael, it will be better if you make a decision over analyzing a problem, find a compromise. So <laughs> I, I'm going to give you what I'm channeling with this card, being at cross purposes. A lot of you watching this, you're at cross purposes with yourself. Yes, you're not sure what you want. You know how you feel, but maybe there's a narrative out there or there's conditioning in your family that says you shouldn't want that or you shouldn't be going in that direction or I cannot tell you how often a family dynamic whether that is culturally based I said what I said culturally based um just you know ancestral patterns whatever it is it's like we don't do such things and usually it's something that's like I'm not even talking about like something that makes you a good person or a bad person. I'm talking more like we do not, you know, drink Kool-Aid on Sundays. You know, like what? Why? <laughs> why? Or uh, maybe there's maybe there's that reason that you, a lot of you just thought of. Um, or you see what I'm saying? Like it's just something that is kind of just made up. It's just made up. And yet someone sort of attached it to something that would be really on PC to argue about and that's how they get away with it so I don't care if your family comes from a long line of business owners if you say hey I want to go be a teacher you know you shouldn't be restricted by your ancestors choices you feel me now a lot of you who do this ancestor worship that might sound almost blasphemous to you Maybe not. If you're a healthy one, you'd be like, no, I'm totally with you. I totally, yeah. They handled their timelines. You handle yours. And that, I think, is what we're talking about with this. Breaking free of that clash between this is who I want to be and this is who I'm expected to be. Okay? So we're going to leave it there. I'm sending you all so much love and take care.